hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you in Windows application how to search records using combo box control and display selected record into a data grid view control start And here we got the output. I'm selecting Chetrika. Here are the Chetrika details Black, Peter. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I have created a new project, and this project contains a Form 1 page adding one combo box control into this form one page go to toolbox all window forms combo box double click the form design page first thing I'm importing the namespaces here. We require three namespaces using system.data, system.configuration, system.data.sql client. Here system.data is already added by default in this Windows form. So I'm adding using system.data.sql client to connect the SQL server. And the second one I'm adding the system.configuration namespace using system.configuration the system.configuration namespace is used to access the connection string from the app.config file let's add the data source connection string in the app.config file go to server explorer right click the data connections add connection the server name After adding the server name, I am selecting the database name sample db. Okay. And notice under data connections, we got the sample db database is added. We need this sample db data source. Right click that connection string properties. And the properties, the third one, the data source. Copy this one. Open Solution Explorer. App.config file. Inside the configuration, I am adding connection strings. Add name. I am giving proper name to my connection string. My con connection string. I'm pasting the data source connection string here. Provider name system dot data dot SQL client. After adding the connection string in the app config file, switch to the form one dot cs. In the form load, I'm adding the connection string string main con is equals to configuration manager. Notice in the intelligence the configuration manager is not showing the reason in the solution explorer in the project references folder the system.configuration library is not added. Let's add the system.configuration library. Right click the references, add references. System.configuration, select the checkbox control of the system.configuration, click OK. Notice we got the system.configuration in the reference folder. Configuration manager dot connection strings between double quotes. I'm adding the connection string name. This one, my con, paste here, dot 
connection string SQL connection SQL con is equals to new SQL connection I just created an object for the SQL connection class now in this SQL connection I'm adding the main con string SQL query is equals to the SQL query is a select statement before writing the select statement let's visit my SQL server management studio we will check the table and the column names the table name is a employee table the column I want to display is a name column so let's copy this dbo.employee select name the column name from the table dbo.employee SQL command SQL com is equals to new SQL command which takes two parameters one is a command text SQL query and the second parameter takes a SQL connection object which is SQL con let's open the SQL connection open method SQL data adapter SDR is equals to new SQL data adapter I'm adding a SQL command object data table DT is equals to new data table SDR dot fill I'm filling the data adapter with data table combo box one dot display member is equals to the column name which is a name combo box one dot data source is equals to DT data table object the last one I'm closing the connection string SQL con dot close method that's it we have done the complete coding part it's time to check the results start and here we got the output form 1 see the name column is binded into this combo box control let's add the data grid view control switch to the design mode let's expand this form design page Go to toolbox. I'm expanding the data folder, data grid view control. Press F4. Selected index changer. Double click that one. And here we got the selected index changer. Instead of writing the again the connection string properties, I'm just I'm just copying the whole part. I'm pasting here instead of name I'm adding a star where the column name is name is equals to single quotes plus plus double quotes single quotes and double quotes now between this plus plus I am adding the combo box one dot text dot two string method and I'm deleting the combo box display member and the data source here I'm adding the data grid view one dot data source is equals to DT that's it let's check the results start And here we got the output. I'm selecting Chetrika. Here are the Chetrika details. Black. Peter. That's it.